right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big-time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big-time actors? Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. A straight punch lands. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. And he's landing upside his opponent's head over and over again. There's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good match. Oh, and he lands yet another knee, and sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Powerful leg kick land. Beautiful strike. The Korean Superboy gets hit by that kick to the body. There he goes, working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch, and the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Big punch land. Ooh. And a nice left hand there on the inside. Got to start his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Right punches there. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. You are battering that nose. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Big kick land. Kick to the body by Albu. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watching this guy and going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. And both guys really throwing with authority. Ooh, big shot land. And he landed the right hand there. Albu's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Beautiful hook. Right hand. Oh, a little single collar tie there. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Just misses there with the left. Lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Good series of punches by him there. He has been busy throughout. He's doing a great job with the hands. He looks like a professional boxer out there. Albu's kick to the body, that one blocked. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. 
Round two is next. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, straight right. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. All right, he engages in a single power tie here, timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Unable to connect there. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Missed with that attempt. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Look at how he turns. Yeah. 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 He lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Back and forth we go. Go. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Three minutes remain in the round. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right. That one appeared to stun him. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Big knee to the body. Oh, straight right. Nice kick. Now we're just going to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Great punch. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job. Oh, of him. Back to the feet. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. Nice punch there by Albu. Hold your ground. I need you to head Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Beautiful body kick. Albu's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Lands a left punch there, and a lot of it's set up by good footwork. Really great footwork and setting traps so that he can land that beautiful left hand. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. 
continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night.